I came from, but it seemed like a big idea for a fifth grader. I just realized all my friends' moms complained about makeup, but what I thought was really weird was that they all had makeup. It blew me away that something that's like so fundamental was so hard for so many people. I really never let go of that idea. I needed to come up with a way to make makeup easy. I didn't want to be a makeup artist per se. I wanted to own a makeup company. So I'll just tell you like, basically the story. I've been wanting to do like some sort of a tool for highlighting and contouring to make it easier. Why are we doing all of these layers? Why don't we have these products have coverage so that we can put them all on in one layer just by placing them in the right places? It just seemed like such a no-brainer. I called my sister, I'm like, I just had the idea. This is a golden idea. This is the best idea I've ever had. I just started making these videos. At the time, there were hundreds of beauty blogs. I just didn't know. It was just so fun because I wasn't making any money. I didn't know how it would somehow become a makeup line from what it was. It just seemed like something I could do. A lot of my most popular posts were like my mommy makeup because it was just like, oh, she makes it easy. She makes it realistic. getting like 3 million hits a month on the vlog, but the vlog's free. So I didn't know if it would translate. And then we were sold out by halfway through the next day. It was so cool. It just grew and grew and grew. It was so exciting to help people look more beautiful than they ever had and really understand how beautiful they are. What's cool about the 3D foundation is because it enhances everything amazing about your face, it's almost like you still even know you're more beautiful after you wash it off. I entirely blame my success on the people that supported me. Nick has been such a partner to me. I would never have done it if I didn't have him. I don't think you have to be single and I don't think you have to not have kids in order to be successful. The real stuff is your life. That's really my message is not that you can do it all, but like if you put the right things first, then it'll fit in, it'll fit together. To be able to really connect with people and help them look beautiful. Like it's such an intimate thing. I think it's mostly because of the people that supported me.